today we are going to do a question from continuity and differentiability. The question is number of points where the given expression is not differentiable in the interval 0 to 3 pi open. The given expression is mod of x f of x plus mod of x minus 2 minus 1 mod close. And where f of x is given as product k is varying from 1 to infinity 1 plus 2 cos 2x upon 3 to power k and whole divided by 3. Now the first thing here which we have to do is first we need to simplify f of x because the moment we simplify f of x we'll get number of points where this expression is non-differentiable. So let's focus on this term. This term is 1 plus 2 cos 2 theta in this form. So let's start start with this term only. So I'm starting with sine 3 theta here. So sine 3 theta is 3 sine theta minus 4 sine cube theta. Now your question is why I'm starting with this. See, I'm on right hand side, I'll try to convert this expression into 1 plus 2 cos 2 theta in this format. So for that, I'm going to take, uh, I think I'm going to take sine theta common here and remaining is 3 minus 4 sine square theta. Now from sine square theta, I can go in the direction of cos 2 theta simply. So I can write this as sine theta multiplied by 3 minus 2 times of, I can write this as 1 minus cos 2 theta. And I can... Again, multiply inside and I can write this as uh, 3 minus 2 is 1 and minus or minus plus 2 cos 2 theta. Now, as I told you, I'll try to convert into this form. So here we have sine 3 theta as sine theta into 1 plus 2 cos 2 theta. So I'll move in this direction. Now I'm going to do one thing, this 3 theta, I'm going to first put x. Now, after this, I'm going to put this 3 theta as x by 3. And then I'm going to put x by 3 square and then so on. Now I'll tell you the reason why I'm doing this. So let's start with this only. Let's just start with 3 theta. I'm putting this as x only. So from here, sine of x can write sine of x as if 3 theta is x, then theta is x by 3. So I can write this as sine x by 3 multiplied by 1 plus 2 times cos of 2x by 3. Now I'm trying to generate this term here that the whole, the whole objective is we have to generate this term only. Now, similarly, I'm going to write 3 theta as x by 3 here. So I'm going to get here sine of x by 3 is equal to sine of x by 3 square multiplied by 1 plus 2 cos of 2x by 3 square here. Similarly, I'm going to put x by 3 square here. So we'll get sine of x by 3 square is equal to sine of x by 3 cube multiplied by 1 plus 2 cos of 2x by 3 cube. Now, similarly, I'll do it till n, okay, till infinite term, I'm going to do it. Let's say I'm doing for nth term, okay. Now, if you multiply all these terms, okay, from left hand side and right hand side, I think sin x by 3, sin x by 3 will cancel out, sin x by 3 square, sin x by 3 will cancel out. And similarly, it will cancel out on the left hand side remaining is sin of x only remaining on the right hand side, what is remaining? I think product is remaining. And in the end, one term will be remaining of sine that is sin of x upon 3 is to power n is remaining here and product of all these terms are remaining product of all this term that is here we'll get this as 1 plus 2 cos of you can say here 2 x by 3 raised to power n and this n is varying from 1 to you can say n because right now I have taken till nth term so I got sine of x is equal to this now let me erase this part now we have calculated the product till n terms now we have to calculate product till infinite terms so in that case, I need to take limit on both sides. So on the left hand side, I'll get sine of x on the right hand side. We have limit n is tending towards infinity because infinite terms product I want. And we'll get this as sine of x upon 3 is to power n. Now, if you notice one thing as x is tending towards uh, as n is tending towards infinity, x upon 3 is to power n is tending towards 0. And I know sine theta by theta theta tending towards 0 is 1. So this will be a standard limit. So on both sides, I'm going to divide by x here in order to simplify the limit. Now with x, I think also I need 3 is to power n here. So I'm going to divide and multiply by 3 is to power n. Now I'm going to write this product as it is. We got product n is varying from 1 to infinity this time, or you can say n. n remaining is 1 plus 2 cos of 2x upon 3 is to power n. Now whole divide by here. As I told you, I have divided by 3 is to power n, so I have to multiply by 3 is to power n here. Now we will have here sine of x by x is equal to limit n is tending towards infinity, sine theta by theta, theta tending towards 0 is 1, so this limit is 1. 
and now remaining is product now so far i have taken the product i didn't take 3 is to power n inside in the product because 3 is to power n i have multiplied from my side so now i'm going to take 3 is to power n inside the product so i think i can write directly this as 1 plus 2 cos of 2x upon 3 is to power n and divide by 3 here because why i'm taking 3 because if i multiply infinite times 3 3 3 i'll get 3 is to power n and as n is varying from 1 to n and i have taken here limit and is tending towards infinity so this is our given expression don't you think this is f of x this is f of x so we got f of x as equal to sine of x by x now i think i'm comfortably can solve the problem i can calculate the number of points where this expression is non-differentiable so let's calculate now after finding the function f of x is equal to sine of x by x all i have to do is find the number of points where this expression is non-differentiable in the interval 0 to 3 pi so i'm going to substitute f of x as it is here we'll get this as mod of x multiplied by mod of sine of x upon mod of x plus mod of mod of x minus 2 and minus 1 and mod close here so in general i know that mod of x will be not differentiable when inside material is 0 here so let's start with the points at which it is 0 so let's start with the first function it is 0 mod of x is 0 at x is equal to 0 since i'm calculating the open interval 0 to 3 pi both are open i'm not going to include 0 but i can include pi because sine of x is 0 at x is equal to pi and one more point is there 2 pi although i want to take 3 pi but 3 pi it's open here so only two points from the first function that is pi and 2 pi let's calculate for the second function now all we have to do is we have to find the points the values of x where inside material is 0 so i think for the smaller mod i think the point is x is equal to 2 here because at x is equal to 2 this is 0 and one more point we have here is if i put x is equal to 3 so inside material will be 0 so because if you put x is equal to 3 here we'll get this as 3 minus 2 that is 1 and 1 minus 1 0 now one more point i'm missing that is x is equal to here 1 the moment you put x is equal to 1 here you'll get 1 minus 2 and mod of minus 1 is 1 and 1 minus 1 again 0 the total number of points of non-differentiability are in front of you and the total number of points are as you can see from here pi 2 pi 2 3 1 total number of points are 5 points and that will be all